y'all and welcome back to my channel. I know I have been in my A for a minute, but I'm back with a new video. We're gonna get into this crusty dusty hair that has been neglected for a while and in a desperate need of some intensive TLC. So let's get into these products so I can achieve this lightweight wash and style go for the day. Y'all, who knew this pre-poo came in a big old jar? Amazon, y'all, Amazon. I'll put the link in the description box below. I'm starting with the pre-poo first just to wake up my curls. This is an amazing moisture rich pre-poo, y'all. I use it to work up some of the product off my hair before moving on to the protein treatment. So I'm gonna thoroughly work this in and then I'll let it sit for about five to 10 minutes before washing it out. Now onto my protein treatment from Curlsmith. I love using this Bond Curl Rehab Sap, which is a bonding treatment for weak damaged hair. Y'all, I don't know what happened, but I just had a moment where I didn't feel like doing anything to my hair, for real, for real. And so I'm suffering the consequences of that with lots of shedding and breakage. And as quiet as it's kept, I did not feel like filming at all. I did not have the energy to pick up the camera to film anything, to do anything with YouTube. I guess I was just experiencing YouTube burnout. But anyway, I'm gonna slather this all over my hair and since my hair is low porosity, I'm gonna leave it in for 15 minutes and then wash it out. Fifteen minutes later, now I'm washing out the bonding cream. Now to move on to a good scalp scrub and detox treatment from the brand Root to End. These are Dollar General products. They are five dollars each and are great quality products with quality ingredients that work very well on my hair. This scalp scrub has a very pleasant scent and it really lifts and dissolves all the product buildup off of my scalp and my hair with apple cider vinegar as one of its key ingredients. And as you can see, these products are free from all of the nasties that you don't want in your hair. I like to massage the scrub in for about a minute and then go in with the shampoo for a more thorough cleanse. Although the shampoo is a detoxing shampoo, it leaves my hair feeling very soft and moisturized without feeling stripped of my hair's natural oils. For the part of the wash day that I cannot wait to get to is the deep conditioning. I'm using Pattern Beauty Intensive Conditioner, which is wonderful for low porosity hair. It has a very thick, buttery, smooth feel that glides through my curls. It's very nourishing and moisturizing to prevent dryness and breakage with its key ingredients, shea butter, avocado oil, and vitamin E. My hair loves a thick conditioner because it leaves my scalp super conditioned and my curls very juicy. Since my hair has been neglected from a good deep conditioning for a while, I'm gonna leave this on my hair for about 30 minutes under a plastic cap. I know this is probably counterproductive, but this is the 10-in-1 Hair Growth Oil from Hair Growth Co. I like to lock in my moisture with this lightweight oil, even though I'm keeping my hair short and not trying to grow it. A little crazy, I know. This oil absorbs into my hair and scalp really well. It's low porosity friendly and it leaves a very soothing, tingling feel on my scalp, so that's why I like to use it. I actually didn't use as much as it looks because a little goes a long way. Next, I'm going in with the Detangling Nectar from Pattern. Although this product is made for detangling the hair, I find it very useful as a leave-in slash styler for my short curls. I love the nectar consistency. It softens the texture of my hair when slightly wet or works even better to rehydrate my hair as a refresher when it's dry. Its key ingredients are sea moss, aloe vera, and grapeseed oil. So it has a lot of slip. Leaving my hair feeling very soft, smooth, curls defined, and a nice shine when it dries. And FYI, it does dry clear, no flakage. Now I can stop right here with the detangler as my final styler, but I gotta be a little extra by using the pattern mousse. Needless to say, I love all pattern products that I've ever used. Just great quality products and ingredients just overall for natural hair. So I'm just gonna go in lightly with the mousse just for just a little extra hole, a little extra definition, not much. Doesn't take a lot. I don't have that much hair, so I don't need a lot. And then I'm just gonna finish it off by doing my edges and that's pretty much my lightweight wash and go style. 
Maybe in the next video, I'll show you some of my heavier products uh, when I'm going for a different type of look or style. I'll show you some of the heavier products that I like to use for my stylers. But overall, this is it, y'all. This was just an intensive hair treatment, a well-needed overdue intensive hair treatment that I needed to do. This is my look, this is my style, and again, these are all the products that I used. And I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and watching me use all these products and doing my hair. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and hopefully I will see you on the next one before the year is out. I hope I do. But if not, then Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. <laughs> but hopefully I'll bring another video for you guys in the future, before the new year. All right, guys. See ya.